Duel is often considered Spielberg's first feature film. Well, okay, sometimes people say that The Sugarland Express is Steve Spielberg's first film, but since Duel eventually got theatrical distribution, I'll say this counts as his first film. Also, I just want this to be his first film because it's so awesome! And because it's so awesome, it was upgraded from TV and made longer and given a theatrical run, but mostly in Europe and Australia. The film is about a man whose literal last name is Man, who is stalked and harassed by an unknown driver in a terrifying looking truck. Who's terrorizing this man? We don't know. It doesn't really matter. The fun in the movie is wondering what is going to happen next and how is this guy going to get away from this maniac. Most people like to compare the truck's motivation to the shark in Jaws. It's not the reasoning that's important. Spielberg takes advantage of this simple premise and creates scenes with riveting action and high suspense. It's kind of like if Mad Max were stripped down more and made into a thriller. It does lack the great characters, memorable score, and just overall class of a film like Jaws. But for what it is, it's still a very well-made suspenseful movie. There's a scene where the killer truck first really attacks the lead character. Not only does he try to run him over, he runs over some random reptile cages. Which just adds even more suspense! Duel is also lacking in a lot of Spielberg's cliches that he'd become known for, and it actually works in the movie's favor. Usually Spielberg presents kids as angelic, more of the way we think of kids rather than the way they actually are, but in this scene he almost, well, he almost uses these kids as tormentors. It's a very strong film debut, and no doubt impressed a lot of people, even if general audiences were slow to catch on. If you haven't seen it, and even if you're not a big fan of Spielberg, it's well worth checking out.